Thanks for Shout having us back to Nation TV. TV. Seen, to be the dudes covering everything, so... Yeah, if you want to keep up to there with anything, it's probably Black Nation TV is where it's at. It's homies supporting homies, yeah? Yeah. Black Nation TV. Black Nation TV. So we're about a year old, been trading for about eight months, um, selling out of Durban, Joburg, Cape Town, Hong Kong, Jakarta, California, um, with plans for more US stores this year and hopefully some stores in the UK and Europe. Working, we just dropped our kind of holiday range, which went really well, it's, up, it's here at Dip. Um, we went to all the stores, it went really well, and just kind of working on the new stuff now for leading up to like the winter season, so it's been more jackets, more pants, um, different silhouettes, different colours, but the still kind of same like muted colour palettes, clean look that, we, that we've been going for. Um, been here for Jovic for the night, we had our launch, um, did friends with, this is Louis. Hey, what's up? I'm Louis. This is friends. It's like a, a zine we put together over the last like four months. Yeah, um, basically, uh, friends put together. It's like a, it's a free zine, um, no ads whatsoever. Uh, Matt and I started it um, like August last year, so we've been working on it for the past few months. Uh, we launched in Cape Town a couple weeks ago, Durban last week, and now successfully in Joburg last night. So basically, the jam is we had um, uh, content from uh, most of South Africa, so like Durban, Joburg, Cape Town, and there's one contributors from Hong Kong, Seoul, uh, and New York. Um, yeah, it's just a, it's just a catalog of uh, of basically our friends who are doing rad shit. And Matt and I were talking when we when we like we're thinking of putting out some sort of zine or something to do with Soul Soul. Um, we were just kind of talking, saying like how rad it is that all our homies are are doing cool shit. Through, like people are being productive, like making stuff, um, and yeah, they're just doing awesome shit. And so that's kind of how the idea of friends came about. You know, we were looking around and saying like, wow friends are doing awesome shit so let's document it you know and it's yeah. and it's it's kind of inspiring you know when you when you see uh, your peers like your homies doing doing rad shit like making strides like like breaking down walls and that and it's like it's inspiring when you see them doing that and you're like fuck okay cool I need to up my game and I, yeah. like we can do that you know it's also because it's like closer to home it's not like you're seeing somebody in the other side of the world doing this crazy stuff and it's like it just seems like so out of reach these are like dudes that we've like grown up with or have grown up in like similar circles and come from similar backgrounds and just like killing it back. Yeah. And it's got everyone, it's got skaters, artists, designers, entrepreneurs, restaurateurs, guys who start their like their own like beer labels, coffee labels. Um, it's cool. And it's really it's like a nice combination of like really good reading content, like interesting stuff. And then also just like laid out amazingly. So yeah, Louis all the creative stuff. Yeah. And it was also pretty cool because there was no one like, because there were no like advertisers, there's no one saying like, here's some money, but go in this direction. So you kind of cop launch to just do like whatever the fuck you wanted to. Like, there were no, like, no rules essentially. Yeah. Like, um, didn't kind of stick to any like classic, like, I don't know, editorial standards. Just yeah. whatever you want to do. And it's, I mean, well, it's the first time we've, any of us have like done something like this. So we kind of, making up the rules as we go along, you know, and it's, it seems to be working so far, so yeah. uh, we've got plans to issue two, but um, yeah, we'll, we'll see how that goes, you know. Uh, it's just the thing of, like, obviously Matt's doing his uh, soul soul stuff full-time, I've also got a full-time job, so it's this is kind of like a love project, you know, that we, we try to get out 
when we can, when the project's right, when the people are right, when the money's there. So, and it looks like people are taking interest and people are responding to it. So, yeah. we're looking, looking like there will be a shit too in, in the, the near future. future. Yeah. Cool. So, we can combine the magazine. So, yeah, there's like a thousand copies and we pr pretty much <laughs> those disappeared at launches. Yeah. But so, we had the, the Cape Town Day of Enjoyment launch where it was just out there for people to just take as many as they wanted. You ask guys to kind of take one per person, but now now that's done, so they're pretty much going to go to release them at the release them at the coffee shops um, in all the cities. We're going to get some to New York and Hong Kong and Seoul as well for the guys that contributed there. Um, so yeah, it'll be it'll be pretty it'll be pretty much found like the people who enjoy the zine, like they'll know where to find it because it'll be all the spots ahead of regularly. If you know, you know, right? Yeah. Any social media or anything where you can find you guys like this also? Yeah, Louis, like, um, Louis is anti social media, <laughs> <laughs> anti technology, so you're not going to find them. Actually, you've got the House of Skullboy. Uh, yeah, I've got skullboy.co.za, it's my website for uh, my fine art stuff. Uh, but you can find friends on Facebook, uh, forward slash uh, occasional friends. And you can get updates. It's just a place where we can kind of keep people updated about what's going on and also direct people to the contributors, you know, like it's, it's yeah. like that's what it's about. It's like it's about our homies making like making work. And so we use the site we use Facebook to direct people to to our homies' work. So yeah. Yeah. And then um, you can see find us at soul soulmenswear.com, that's the website, and then Instagram just at soul soulmenswear. Um, that's the best place to keep up to date with like, the new stuff we're doing, um, new launches coming up. Um, yeah, when we get involved with things like that, that's probably the best, best way to find everything. Yeah. What up, what up? It's your boy Calvin X, Black Nation TV. You're watching Barcelona's, and we're out here in Dip Street Store, San Brum, where you can find all the latest and dopest clothing out here. Wild. So, we just wrapped up a quick interview. The man Matthew from Soul Soul here at Dipstow. We yes. hanged out with him yesterday. Throughout the day, he had a young gallery going on. He launched some magazine, as you can see. This is what's up. So come check it out. It's got all the craziest ish. Or you can just stay tuned to Black Nation TV and find out what's the latest trend, what's the latest illest shit in the streets. And just, you know, follow me, your boy Calvin X on Fossil. It's Black Nation TV, baby. Holla.